Our farm's name is the Elliott Homestead. This is our home. We're homesteaders. We get up with the sun. We go down and feed the animals. Sally! I love getting the eggs and getting some vegetables from the garden. I love fresh oregano. And whipping up a frittata. This bacon is like no other bacon in the world. With freshly baked bread, home preserved jams. Mm. You have not lived until you've had fresh cream from a dairy cow. Mm. And I'm talking like into the bucket, skim it off in your morning coffee. That's when you know you're really living. Seriously, that's really good. You guys want to try some? <laughs> Let's make some more. I'm Shay Elliott. Oh, like I'm a wife. First of all, like, what are you really doing strange. here? <laughs> I'm a work at home mom. Poor Owen. I'm a blogger. And I'm a farmer. I'm a home cook. My cooking style is very simple, but looks really fancy, even though it's anything but. This is just good, rustic farm food. A chicken served atop a bed of rice. You can really smell that honey. Stuffed with dried fruits that we've preserved. I got these from a friend's orchard. You can enjoy them all through the winter. Very little effort. I'll fry up a steak in our cast iron skillet with lots of butter. Everything browns better with butter. Tastes better, too. Maybe some greens from the garden. I'll take cabbage and I'll cure it into kimchi. I'm just gonna enlist the help of my husband to muddle it down. Try to get a little violent with it. It's not very pretty. <laughs> it doesn't have to be complicated. There's nothing precise about this recipe. I'm a mother to young kids. I need to get some food on the table and I have a half an hour to do it. This kind of cooking makes it possible. It just takes a few minutes to throw together in one pan. Doesn't get any better. Once the kids go to bed, that's when I get to work on the computer. This blog is everything I love. It's what daily life looks like for us. We started homesteading when every dime mattered. We can and dehydrate a lot of fruit. This is our first year as beekeepers. I got requests from readers to take all of the recipes and turn them into a book. This dish screams summer. And out of that came From Scratch, which was our first cookbook. That sizzle so it gives it that really nice flavor. Just give them a quick poke, which is going to make peeling them a lot easier. The cooking is why we do everything that we do. The flavor is so fantastic, I can't wait to dive in. But you do not have to live on a farm to enjoy food like this. Hey, Amy. All you have to do is find local sources. Mm. So good. You can go to a supermarket and just pick up basic ingredients. Fresh tomatoes, lots of fresh pepper. <laughs> this is my way to show people that I love them. We're foodies and we love to eat. Cream makes everything taste delicious. Yum. Mm. I love food. And tomorrow? we get to do it all over again.